This adventurous team encountered cannibal ants. They were devoured by the ants in seconds. This man mistakenly enters a weird town where all the villagers are dummies. He rushes out of the house to check, not realizing that there are no living people outside either. Suddenly, he found an atomic bomb hanging not far away. It turns out that the dummies here and the town are used to do nuclear explosion experimental bomb. Just then, there was a sudden alarm in the air. The man rushes up the street and tries to drive away, but his companions left him behind. There were only the last 20 seconds left before the explosion. The man had to run back to his room and try to find a place to hide. But what could withstand the power of a nuclear explosion? Just when he was helpless, he saw a refrigerator. He threw out everything inside, then at the last two seconds got into the refrigerator and quickly closed the door. The next second, the nuclear explosion came head on, and the town was instantly Unexpectedly, the refrigerator not only carried the nuclear explosion, but he also landed on the ground intact after flying over several mountains. The man was then taken to a bath by the military to clean off the nuclear bomb radiation from his body. That's when he is given a new mission to find the legendary Golden Land. It turns out that the man's name is Jack and he is an archaeologist. A few days ago, he and his assistant David were exploring an ancient tomb and inadvertently found a corpse wearing a gold mask. And after removing the mask from above, they actually found a crystal skull. Although the crystal head, but it has a strong magnetic force, can be sucked around the iron over. Legend has it that this crystal skull is the key to open the Golden Kingdom. They soon set off. The woman was surrounded by cannibal ants and her feet were densely packed with them. Seeing that there was no way to escape, she grabbed a rope from a tree and climbed up. However, the cannibal ants actually built a ladder to climb up. The woman hurriedly gathered her legs, but one still climbed up. Luckily, help arrived in time and saved the woman. But the others weren't so lucky and were eaten by the cannibal ants on the spot. At the moment of crisis, Moncler outlet online. He took out his crystal skull and blocked himself. The cannibal ants surprisingly made a detour. They escaped back to the car. But a new problem came. There was a 10,000 feet cliff in front of them. Jack tried to stop the car. But Alice pressed the gas to the bottom and went straight down the cliff. They were caught by a large tree. The weight of the car bent the tree and slowly descended to the river. Finally Alice drove the car into the river. Not realizing that cars could actually walk in water. Ahead of them was a large waterfall of thousands of meters. Several people fell down the current. But they emerged unharmed. A few people were just relieved. But they didn't realize that there was another big waterfall in front of them. This time, they weren't so lucky. And the people were directly thrown out. But they weren't seriously hurt when they climbed up the bank. David suddenly realized that there was a giant skull statue on the hill not far away. They carefully entered the cave, which was covered with various mysterious murals of people exactly like the crystal skull. They were about to move on when a group of savages suddenly appeared on the walls, scaring them so much that they immediately fled. The savages chased after them and soon they were surrounded by them. Suddenly, the savages retreated in panic, which turned out to be Montclair Outlet's store the crystal skull. After getting rid of the savages, a few people came to an ancient building. This should be the legendary gold country. The man raised a huge stone and ruthlessly smashed it down towards the stone statue, which instantly spat out mud and sand. This was the secret to activating the organ. The crowd smashed all the surrounding stone statues, as several stone pillars slowly emerged. Together, the entrance to the Golden Kingdom appeared underneath. The few people continued on and soon came to a treasure cave, which was piled high with exotic treasures. Jack suddenly found a large door, and he slowly placed the crystal skull onto the mechanism. The mechanism slowly activated and a secret room appeared in front of everyone's eyes. This was actually a palace made of pure gold. In the center of the palace was a statue without a skull. As they tried to get closer to check it out, a few mercenaries who were trailing behind suddenly killed out, and the bad woman chased after them. Then the woman grabbed the crystal skull as she tried to attach it. However the crystal skull unexpectedly flew up by itself. Then the next second, the crystal skull actually came to life. The woman began to make a wish to the crystal skull, hoping to get the divine power to rule the world. As soon as the words left her mouth, the palace began to shake violently. They looked up and an alien ship actually appeared above their heads. It turned out that this golden kingdom was the base of the aliens. The bad woman chose to stay in order to get the divine power, but she was unable to support the huge power and eventually turned to A few of Jack's men escaped. Just then, the underground water came swooping in and they had no way to escape. Fortunately, the underground water washed them up. 
they walked up high and looked, only to see the entire Golden Kingdom instantly crumble. An alien ship slowly rose up, and as it did, it left Earth.